tell you, take out all your napkins, because sometimes you can actually laugh until you cry. <laughs> this is going to be one of those times. This is really what put that line in our advertisement about a little bit of Kevin's uh, open mic night, which says, you can expect the unexpected. Yeah. You could. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. He's zany. He's crazy. He's the most creative person I've ever met in my whole life. Medication. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you are in for the time of your life. So hold on and welcome Pete Fantastic. Can, can I just move this out of the way? Yes, you can. Because if, if you take. <laughs> wait, wait, let me let me see it for you. Say goodbye, Mr. Bar. <laughs> Hello, Miss Poppins. I'm here to clean out your chimney. <laughs> so Long Island PD, we're coming in. Put down those crack pipes. Put down those crack pipes. <laughs> Okay to 
laugh when you're a Christian. <laughs> no, I like performing for Christians because you're so unjudgmental. <laughs> you know, it's very clear to me that God has a line not to cross over. That's the line I'm concerned about. But you people, there's a line every place I look. <laughs> I like to go to the post office because, see, I just don't do comedy per, per se on a comedy stage. See, God gave me a gift, but it's not a gift unless you give it. It's just hard to find people that want it. <laughs> but I give it anyway, nonetheless. I'm an ex-clown, actually. I'm a Ringling Brothers and Barn and Bailey. I'm an ex I'm an ex-circus clown because the, well I'm in the clown witness protection program. <laughs> I'm not allowed to put my makeup on because there was a lot of complaints. <laughs> the other clowns they couldn't get any work because they said, You're not doing my birthday party. <laughs> I saw that Potomsky guy, you're out of your mind, baby. <laughs> I can't trust you and my kids. You get them so hypey, they never go to sleep for three weeks. <laughs> but at least they had fun. <clears throat> I am the Three Stooges. I'm the Three Stooges on steroids. <laughs> I, I don't need to... Th I, I cut the middle man out of the Three Stooges. I beat the heck out of myself. <laughs> That's how God made me. I'm very indestructible. Look at that. I don't feel a thing. That's not normal. I'm telling you. Oh, I like to go to the post office, especially around Christmas time, because in Long Island, why do they call Long Island an island? Isn't an island a happy place? Long Island? Long Island? You ever drive down the street there and you cut someone off? You ever seen the nice Long Island people? I'll kill ya! I'll kill ya! And those are the nuns. Those are the nuns. They're tense here in Long Island. So tense. So I like to go to the post office. I like to go to the post office and go, Excuse me, do you have any stamps with the adhesive predominantly on the left side? Why do we go to the right? Oh, oh, no. How many people are doing business is not an actor? Do you get the feeling whether you're here or not, I'm going to go off like a bottle rocket? I just need a good, I just need a big mirror. I'm good for hours. You know what I like to do? I like to go to Comp USA. In, in, Comp, in Comp USA, people are very tense when it comes to computers. It's, it's a very tense area in people's lives. I don't know because I, I, I can't compute. I can't. I don't drive. It's just too much information. Do you ever, you, you ever drive and you see all those road signs? There's like a million road signs and it's all this thing. I just get out of my friend's car and I start barking. <laughs> it's just too much information. Right out of my mind. Well, you have to have one to go out first. So I'm always out there. But anyway, I like to go to Comp USA just to break up the tension there. Because remember, I'm not just a clown on stage. I like to go around, make, you know, bring, bring, bring joy to people. <laughs> Lady, what happened? We were so close. We were so, you and me, we were so. Well, I know, this will make you happy. Wait, who has a purse? <laughs> who has a purse? Let me borrow. Let me go. No, let me see this. Let me, oh, let me get this purse. Can, can I do that? Let me, no, let me, let me, let me, let me. Oh, that's a beauty. Look at that.
going! starting already.
many people missed that flip? I'll do it one more time. Here's the flip. Ready? Here we go. Here we go, the flip this side. Ready? Can you see? I want them to get a good... This is, this is really good when you walk into a chiropractor's office. And you go, Doc, I got this... Uh, I don't know, every time I got this problem with my pelvic, every time I do this, is this a problem? <laughs> so is that a problem? And if that doesn't get him nervous, say I'll see you next Thursday with my lawyer. <laughs> Clown, it was a bottle. <laughs> Hi, this is Samantha, and I hope that you're enjoying this faith-filled, wholesome entertainment. Do you know that over 50,000 guests have been through our doors? Do you know that we'd love you to be one of them? If you would like to attend, then simply call us at 631-262-1212, and we'd be happy to send you out a free brochure and a free calendar of events. You can come alone, make a friend, or bring a friend. This place was designed just for you. Let's get back to the show. Enjoy. Here's Cher, Cher, the actress singer. Look at the face. <laughs> Cher laughing. Robert De Niro, Lil Robert De Niro. <laughs> De Niro sucking a lemon. Because why does De Niro have that lemon sucking face to begin with? <laughs> if he sucked a lemon. Together. They wrote themselves. 
Okay, you got it, you got it. I'm so excited. This is going to be my last time in Samantha's a little bit of heaven. Because we've been filming for three days now. Okay, okay, here we, here we go. This is Sylvester Stallone. Now, I'm a method actor, right? So he's a little fatter for this role. Remember, and also, he's a very good actor because, remember, he was deaf. So he, his speech wasn't as audible. Hey, yo, 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 detective. I don't want to get involved. <laughs> talking to me? You talking to me? Yeah, I'm talking to you. Yeah, I'm expoundiating, I'm exfoliating, I'm pronunciating. Yeah, absolutely, I'm talking to you. Absolutely. It's not talking. You're mumbling. You're mumbling. You're mumbling. I want, to, I want to show you these. I got these new pants. Look, these are, these are special pants. You can't get these at Target or Walmart. You got to go to the big man, tall man store. I like to walk into the tall man and big man store and go, excuse me, sir. I'm looking for some spandex pants that I can hoist up to my esophagus with some big little daisies. So I can walk around the mall and you know, how's your game? And usually the cops are chasing me. Come on, flat foot! to pass out. It's time for me to lower my IQ slowly. This is me getting stupid. Thank you. Austin for Anthony. Lowering my IQ slowly. Thank you. Anthony, you're going to be okay or should we get your room? How many people are convinced I need a lot of prayer? God, help me focus this energy before I'm going to kill somebody. <laughs> With laughter only. <laughs> you know, there's a lot of single women here tonight. You know, I just want to let you know, were you married? I would, and I wasn't looking at you. I was married. A lot of married women here tonight. And uh, this is not about me finding a baby. <laughs> no, no, no. I don't need a wife when I'm married to Jesus. <laughs> That's what they tell you, right? Like you buy that, like you buy that. No, of course you do. No, hey, listen, look how much fun we're able to have. It's so nice to be in a club where I could honor Jesus. And, and uh, when I'm doing bad, I say, Jesus, and then you applaud, and then I'm doing good again. Because <laughs> let's be honest, I should have been off 20 minutes ago. <laughs> okay, this is me, okay? This is me lowering my IQ slowly. This is me, I know, this is my last bit, and I'm off. And I won't be back till tomorrow night. Okay. <laughs> Getting stupid at lower IQ. Pantomime, pantomime, no more talking from this moment on. <laughs> but you could laugh.
Petofsky. <laughs>